and welcome to my 12th video of my Linux project today we're going to talk about is how to rip DVDs to your computer using Handbrake but what you gotta do first is install it so what I'm going to get you to do first is open up terminal and then type in sudo app and then hyphen add and then um, hyphen repository space ppa and those two little dot things stippens forward slash handbrake hyphen snap shots click enter and then it's going to go through some stuff <coughs> and then you may have to click enter and then when that's done, keep the uh, terminal open and then type in sudo app hyphen get space update and click enter again and then that's going to do some stuff and then keep terminal open and then type in sudo app or sorry, sudo space app ept hyphen get space install space handbrake hyphen gtk and then turn this go through stuff and then all you need to do then is close terminal and then menu, click on menu send a video and then you got handbrake click on handbrake <coughs> and then wait for it to load while you're waiting you can place a DVD that you want to rip in your in your drive and then click on source and then go to your DVD drive when it loads up you go. You may want to change this here to something, and keep the dot in for V, and then click start. And then it's gonna go through the process. Now I already did something. I already ripped the video. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up files, the file folder down here, and then go to videos videos and that's where it rips stuff to see so I already got something done here and then the, that's where it rips it to so that's how you install and use handbrake but uh, I'm going to tell you why I choose to install it that way is because if you go to software manager and type in handbrake and install it that way you're only going to have the option to use MK4, but installing it my way is you can use MP4, MP4 files or M4V files. So thanks for watching and watch for the 13th episode.